creating tuna. First, it's got to be within your boundaries. Then go to landscape and create a little trench. Oops. <laughs> Try a little trench, uh, not peaks. Then go to the water source. Set it at 50%. Place your water source in there. And you can click and then click again and then lower it down. Basically lower it down until it's just about to the top of what your little trench is. <clears throat> now let's let it run, see what happens. First it's going to indent it and because the water is going to suck it in. It's going to take some time for this to settle down. You'll eventually see a big ring coming around. But you should also see tuna forming. Hmm, look at that. And this is the part that takes a while, but you got to let it run for quite some time. Because what it's going to do is it's going to, it's going to cause this indention first. And eventually that's going to settle back out and flatten back out. But it takes, uh, the first time I did this, it took like almost 10 minutes. I don't know if we're going to let this video run that long. But what it'll do is after time, it'll settle down. And if it doesn't, if you don't like the way it, it looks kind of like you got some indentation or something like that, go into the water level and adjust your water level up and down a little bit to change it. See right now, see this is what I'm talking about. You can see there's a, a ring around here. But what you can see is, is you got an area for tuna. That outer ring will eventually go away, but that inner circle will stay there. And after a while, this outer ring that you can see in the water will go away. Notice the middle is now sort of flat again. Okay, and the outside will, will settle off or settle down and be flat again after a period of time. It's just like any other time you work with water where for a while you got flooding and this and that and the other and then it, then it eventually settles down. Um, this will do the same. So basically just let it run and what you get is you got this little circle with some tuna. And that's it.